To strengthen the church's ability to undertake peace building initiatives, PCOS identifies community leaders to be trained at the International Resource Center for Civil Leadership, better known by its acronym Reconcile. Reconcile was created in 2003 by the former New Sudan Council of Churches as a faith-based ecumenical peace-building organization for communities to heal from their brokenness after five decades of war. Starting from its center in Ye, South Sudan, and reaching out across the nation and into neighboring countries, Reconcile equips grassroots, religious, and government leaders to restore hope and rebuild lives by means of three different programs. Through the Leadership and Governance Program, with its comprehensive curriculum of skills enhancing courses, Reconcile plays an intricate but often quiet role as these leaders learn how to negotiate clashes from among clans, political factions, military forces, and government leaders within embattled communities. In a variety of activities, from personal to peer counseling to sports activities and reconciliation forums, the Psychosocial Rehabilitation Program restores individuals and interpersonal relationships that have endured emotional wounds from conflict. The Reconcile Peace Institute offers a comprehensive three-month training to recommended leaders to equip them with vital skills necessary for facilitating trauma recovery and conflict transformation in their places of influence. RPI's instructors include highly trained experts from Africa, Europe, and the United States of America who are committed to contextualizing their knowledge in a manner which is accessible and practical. As a result, graduates become part of a vast network of peace builders across the country and various ethnic groups, social economic backgrounds, genders, ages, and educational levels. As a longtime PCUSA partner, Reconcile has also trained Presbyterian leaders to better address healing within their own communities and congregations. Reverend Ojulu Omo is one of them. While he was taking his final course at RPI, his village was attacked, home raided, cattle stolen, and father shot. Enraged family members and villagers considered a revenge attack and asked him to return to protect his family. Ojulu, however, knew that revenge would only temporarily satisfy his anger, but lessons learned at Reconcile could change his community forever. Four years later, he is an ordained Presbyterian pastor who's worked extensively in his community, resolving conflict and counseling war survivors in the refugee camps of Gambela, Ethiopia, where many are traumatized. Reconcile's peace-building efforts have become widely recognized from state officials and ecumenical platforms to diplomatic circles and international news agencies. We're thankful for the active participation of the PCOS in all three programs of Reconcile and for the church's contributions in the forms of personal resources through Reconcile staff and Board of Governance.